Okay, let's go. Swish. Yeah, so you don't actually have to swipe it. So I wish you could. And airlock sound. Oh my god, it's actually a scanner? Scans from the bottom that one, from the top that way. Scan back down the other way. It's gonna do a breach, 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 breach. Alert, alert. Mao infected hardware attempting to escape lab. Warning. Mao infected hardware attempting to escape lab. This definitely looks like the area where we saw Captain Beatface against Window or whatever he was. I don't like this. I'm not seeing the vent area above either. I thought we would have thought it was one of these hallways. What's this? System error on a light switch? Void hole? Looking through the whole world, breaking my immersion terribly? <laughs> it's amazing how obvious some of those are when you just see them. It's like. <laughs> I mean, you're looking into the void, the whole universe, just tearing apart in front of you. System error again, on another light switch. Another dead guy. It's interesting to think that the body I'm in is just some woman who... It's funny she described it as like crammed through her skull cavity. But in a way, it's much... It was probably after... She, that's probably not what killed her, really. She was probably killed by something else and crammed through the skull cavity. It's just its way of instead. Ah! Yeah, you can tell that got to me. Yeah, and the, the drippy vent got to me. Um, it's probably its way of installing the chip. It's gonna make noise. I don't like this. Worst throw ever. Well, that's useless. We need to find a fire extinguisher, I guess. They're usually so plentiful. What the hell did that? This is like hardcore dead space shit right here. And it keeps glitching out into the void and showing me LOD issues and letting me see stuff I'm supposed to. God. Right, this is that floor that had all those, um, uh, what do you call it? We're not going in the infirmary yet. We're not going in the infirmary. That's where the thing is. We're not going in there yet. We want to get in that room first to figure out what the hell's up. Doubt the can would be good enough to break it. Oh. And of course I'm making noise with all this. You're not a proxy. Cool. Let's close that door behind us. God, I missed! And vents are pretty safe looking. Pretty safe looking. Oh my god. It's amazing it's not converting their bodies as well. Well, this one definitely looks like it was a woman. So, this one I still can't tell. It sounds like one, though. Um, my god. Well, let's not click on that. Let's not waste it, you know. We might need it. <sighs> Any fire extinguishers in here either. Anyway, whatever. Maybe this will weigh enough to break a window. Just put that down gently there. For God's sakes. Yeah, we can go out here. Just notice the blood goes all the way up to this door. Mother fracker. Try to throw it that way so the noise is last heard over there. Um, I'm trying to figure out if it was him who had... I guess maybe he cut himself up or something cut him. And he ran in here. This game had fire extinguishers everywhere until we get down here. This is an amazing facility, by the way. Uh, while I wasn't recording earlier, I was thinking about um, just how annoying it is to think that they don't have a Mars colony here that's active. Oh, wow. So, yeah, something happened, I guess, in the elevator. Maybe it was that. I thought it was something's head sticking around the corner. Um, God, this is getting to me. Uh, how annoying it was that they don't have, like, a Mars colony or at least a moon colony. At least, like, what, China and Britain are going to be trying to set up a colony on the dark side of the moon? 
Yes. Oh, there we go. He was working on that one. He got hurt, I guess. Maybe. No, it looks like he came from here. What's this? What's in the... Okay, it's just a control panel. Wow, we're not touching none of that yet. It got out of hand. I'm in sector RD4. Did you get everyone downstairs? Yeah, we're safe right now. But you need to get moving. They're gonna figure out where we are and come for us. Don't worry about it. The stairs are blocked and I killed the elevator. Pull the connector chip from the lock. Why? That means you're stuck as well. Only way to keep you guys safe. Take the shuttle, go to Omicron. God damn it, Juan. You just had to be the hero, you bastard. Good luck, sir. Tell Alice I love her. Wow. Crazy brave guy. Unfortunately, those things knew where he was. Which makes me think... This doesn't look like a switch. Why is it giving me like a switch icon? What is a poke? Something's missing. Not like a poke thing. Uh, spear, insert, connector chip. Cool. So do we have to put the connector chip in there and then pull these up to hold it in place? I guess so. I thought they were fuses, and you pulled them out and popped them in different spots. So what, they were down below this floor? He did this to make sure nothing could get down after him? Fog door, keep closed. Great. Awesome. So whatever we heard killed him then, and he spittled back and made his way in there? Is that what I'm seeing? Is there still a few dead people on this floor? I thought this was a floor they were all... S you know, hiding. Apparently not. Maybe it means this floor is safe than I thought. Why don't I just close the door before I've searched the room? That's a brilliant idea. Oh. Uh, survival of the fittest. <laughs> this is their way of joking about them being alive at the bottom of the sea when everything else is toast. Definitely hear something creepy out there. Make any noise. Shh. Wish I knew for sure that they couldn't open doors. I've never seen them open the door, I don't think. Oh, no, I saw the one on top, on the, um... Oh, that sunken submarine ship. It could open doors. Fuck. 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 Oh, yeah, it's definitely close, isn't it? I think I saw a screen spittle for a second. Yep, there it is. The screen is definitely doing fun things. Please be a blind one and not a teleporter. Please be a blind one and not a teleporter. Actually, no. Please be a teleporter. The teleporter ones I know how to deal with. The blind ones are the ones that are finicky. I make sound and they come for me. Should we just touch it? Should we just touch it? Why not? Oh, I'm zooming in. I can't look myself. How the hell are we going to make sure the Ark makes it? Every launch is a crapshoot. You know that. I just wish these numbers <laughs> looked better. What do you care? It's just a pack of data, right? Yeah. Just a pack of data. <laughs> so it looks like even the skeptics were getting a bit... Oh my god, this is our only hope. I guess that's probably what starts to happen, though, when you, uh... Go fuck yourself. Oh, when um, everyone around you starts committing suicide because they believe it and so believe in it so fervently, idiots. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with believing in it, but it's the whole you know let's commit suicide thing. So the only version of us that lives on is the only version of us. It's just us. Ha ha! Aren't we so smart? See what this looks like to me? Hmm? This looks like noise. So what, this was a rocket propulsion room where they thought about rockety stuff? Uh, flames go that way? Bad! Flames go that way? Good! That way? Bad. What? Oh, there's different outputs. Too much! Bad! Perfect! Good! Too little! Too, too, too. Right, okay, propulsion efficiency, yeah, they're trying to get it just perfect. And they're playing Hangman at it. Bladder bursters? Boosters? Quarantine? No, that's not fortune, is it? Golem. They got golem perfectly. God, they're saying these things out there are like golems. 
That thing almost looks like a Minecraft person. Um, let's stand up. Anything? Little mobile hard drive. I can hear a whizzing computer down there. Oh my god, they had one of these cool swish tables. Tap, 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 tap. Also, 100 years in the future just hit me. That's a big monitor. Some of these monitors are very not futuristic. And they were playing hardcore tic-tac-toe. Get four in a row. I'm assuming that's what that is. Hmm. Just standard tic-tac-toe always goes in a draw. <laughs> Uh, I have a funny story about tic-tac-toe for another time. Involving me waking up from a minor procedure at a hospital and wanting to play tic-tac-toe with a nurse. Oh my god, yep, they knew it was going on for more than just a few minutes. Is that an eye? Don't tell me they installed it. Surely not. Oh, this is some hardcore dead space shit now. This is, this, this, I, you tricked me into playing a Dead Space game. I'm alright with that. I'm hardcore alright with that. Just give me a marker at the end of this and we're good. I'm not blocking it, by the way. That is a fucking thing you're not supposed to look at like that. God almighty, this, this makes me think that there is more of something down there than just the Mao. It brings me back to that alien theory. Look at that. It almost like an eye up there as well. Which is possible, true. Maybe that's someone they found with one of those chips stuck into them, a mind being transferred into it. But so much of the mind is kept, it can't be a marker. God. It's weird to see a thermal scan of that, too. Hello? Anyone out there? I can't really see through the window after all. I thought I saw light through a second ago. Oh, yeah, at the corners. That, come on, that made so much noise. Surely it heard that. I hope you're bracing yourself for a sage scream there. I love this station. Hey, uh, Visceral Studios. You ever wanted proof that people would like a uh, first-person Dead Space game where it's like next to no combat? Watch this game sales. Hopefully they do well. Because uh, I'd eat it up. I'd eat it, eat it up. Up, it up, up, up. This looks like a whole world of make sound, doesn't it? Oh, Where's the supports? There should be supports like that, that, like, there's no signs of them being damaged or collapsing in with this. Also, there's water coming in. We're underwater, so water should just eternally keep coming in until it floods, so there must be some sort of basic pumping system running, right? I was in there, right? Yeah, I was in there. That's where the first room I heard spook spooky noises in. Oh, good. Airlock room. More collapsed ways. It's an old... Uh, what? There's no button at all, even. It's an old game, um... I almost wanted to call it trope. Level design trick to have lots of locked doors or hallways collapsed. To make it seem like the facility was originally a lot larger. It's actually a, a, a design type I really, really like. Shit, shit, shit. Good, we actually saw it. Now we just have to hope we're not going to walk right into it. I don't know how close it's walking to the walls, it's a problem. It's following me. Shit. Oops. That'd be terrifying if it was right there. <laughs> I say it in jest. I still haven't found a, um...
fire extinguisher. <sighs> Sorry, I'm having like a full system panic derp right now. Did I leave this door open? I think I did. For now on, we're leaving all the doors open, so if we need to run in the room and close the door, we can. Just check it in here again for fire extinguishers. We already threw some of that out. It didn't do anything. Okay, guys and gals. We're going to double back and go the way the game wants us to go, finally. To the infirmary. Hopefully there'll be something heavy in there. Take people here, if hurt. God. Are you still alive? How are you alive? You're not tied into anything. Is it evolving you? I think that one needs to be female too. Did you attempt suicide with these things? Well... That is noisy as funk. We can't even turn off the lights to like hide in the dark. Man. Okay, well, I guess we're all right in here. Uh, hey, any fire extinguishers in any of this? I hear the footsteps. Let's just hope it can't open doors, eh? That one was already open, wasn't it? Big stone Buddha. That might be able to do it. That might be able to do it. Don't grab me, miss. What a nightmare. I'm assuming she took the pills to try to commit suicide. Or maybe actually she got hurt and came in here to give the blood. I guess it's trying to make her into another proxy. It almost looks like spores in the air around her. Oh, God. Uh, please don't grab me. Okay, Terry Akers, age 66, male. One of the worst cases I've seen, and it's most likely his own damn fault. He blinded himself after clogging up his insides with structured gel. I'd be surprised if he ever woke up from the coma. <sighs> Did make me think of Hart's absurd story about what happened to Lambda. Could it really be that WoW is somehow able to change and rebuild it? Don't tell me something happened to her as she was typing this. Oh no, this is the last entrance. Entry. It's my flashlight turning on and off, by the way, if you hear that sound. So they're saying something happened at Lambda. Oh my god. Oh my god. Heart appears to be in good shape, considering the circumstances. Only bruises and mild hypothermia caused by the long walk. It's difficult to corroborate her stories, as she is the only one to return. So did... Is she one that walked these are? So Akers is the guy who blinded himself from the one station. Cut out his eyes after filling himself with all that stuff and made it back here and attacked somebody. And then apparently came, stood up and killed her, I'm assuming. And then they, the avatars or whatever they called them are now walking around killing everyone else. I can't remember exactly what happened with her. We should have started at the bottom. October, November, December. Uh... Conrad is dead. He boiled his uh, his brains to pulp with a W rim laser, maser, the maser thing from earlier. Following the arc neuroscan, clearly another continuity enthusiast killing himself to take his place on the arc. You know, we've already been there. Just be, whatever. As usual, Shun is qu quiet and does her best to avoid eye contact. She doesn't want to be here, but Stormer demands another evaluation. Chun isn't a abstained or dishonest, but she'd rather not speak if it can be avoided. It's definitely not like Catherine, is it? Mm. Hmm. Catherine Shun is weak in character, the perfect victim to be dominated and pushed around by others. She's a scared mouse I don't want to upset. Hmm. So we sit quiet and pass the time. So there's some fear that if you upset her, trouble might happen. 
I wonder if somebody did push her so far and bad things happened. Or I wonder if this scan we're lugging about. Nah, I don't think it knows something it's not sharing. That honestly doesn't seem likely. God, spooky noises and now oh, it is nearby. There's another one of those really funky water things. It actually has a cup in it this time. Did that turn the nozzle? Nope. Wish I could read that. It all looks too blurry to read and what's there that is legible isn't in English. We're gonna try some. Okay, I think they can open doors. Cool. It's settled then. They can open doors. Now, after it walks away, I think I have Google Translate on my phone? Could I aim it at that and get like a translation from that? Let's see. How do we get to the right apps on the phone? Yeah, 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 Mr. Zombie Man. I know you're out there. Just, yeah, stay there. Uh, translate, translate, translate. Connect that thing, that thing, that thing. Is it just my camera app? So, hey, Mr. Zombie Dude, uh, or Mr. Uh, Prodigy, or Avatar, or whatever they called you, Proxy, I think it was. You know how to get the uh, translation app on your phone? Oh, there it is, Translate. And Photo. Yay! Okay, Align Text. Let's just stand up now. Uh, wrong button. Stand up. Walk forward a little tiny bit. And now look at it. Get nice, close like. And now let's aim my phone at the screen. Aha, align text. There we go. Text is aligned. No, I don't. Oh, shit. Can I have set it to detect language? There we go. It was on set the germ, of course, because it was. Um, camera input isn't available for select le selected language, aka detected language. You are worthless. You have wasted my time. God dang it. I shall have to depend on the internet to translate. It probably says, like, Eternity Juice. My god. I guess this is where he stood up, eh? After he had jabbed out his eyes. It looks like that gunk is did more than... Actually, it looks like he probably... The gunk maybe came out of him. And it also caused, you know, growths. Here we go. Three, chief factor at Delta. <laughs> That's when she died. Odd. She shoveled. I think, I think I will need to consult Dr. Eames at Omicron about this. Awesome. That shoveling sound in the background made me think she was like taking bits of it off of him, or like taking the suit off and slopping some of this away. Alright, well, there's a bloody footprint, so there's even more confirmation that he got up and. First aid, in case of injury, burns. We already read that ages ago. Great. Glass door sealed for probably that close. Oh! <laughs> Sorry, I just expect people in here. One of these days I'm gonna I'm gonna spook myself just ah, uh, and someone's actually gonna be there and just gonna go through the roof with terror. Ah, here's one of the jars, like the one we found in the hallway earlier. Cool. Oh hey, and we saw a picture of this way earlier. Almost looks like a head. It hasn't grown much since I took the picture, though. That almost looks like a torso. This is going some hardcore Dead Space stuff here. Uh, meet you downstairs. 
something in the shuttle. Remarkable connectivity. Nerve patchwork. Okay. Uh, set consumption. Akin. Some biotic attempts. Unnatural growth. Hey, hey. Oh, good. Another vent that I didn't even notice. Great. And this glass is cracked but not breached. Same with that one. So it's... Uh, they knew something was going on. They were studying its the fact that it was growing and merging with walls and stuff. I went through medical and I didn't find the machine, did I? Oh, wait, no. They got it down the towel, didn't they? They got it down the towel. That's why I didn't see it here. Silly sage. It's in the medical area of Tau, not the medical area of... What is this place? Theta. I have to keep looking at a piece of paper right and the name's written down. And their depths. Yeah, here's the map. <laughs> uh, main lift. The big rectangular or octagon. Not rectangular. Yeah, like octagon, hexagon, whatever grid. Security checkpoint. Is that where we are right now? Fucking come in here. Oh, you asshole. Go away. Thank you. Um, so main lift, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I think we're in security, aren't we? And then archive is just down the hall. And a lot of collapsed hallways were, you know, those like uh F1 or whatever rooms. 9, 10, okay, not F numbers, but just 11, 12, 13, 14. That's a lot of collapsed area. Yeah, a lot of the collapsed areas just stuff we can't get to. Oh, we can't even get into the management and casing offices either, apparently. Oh, no, we, we were in there, weren't we? It's the management we can't get into because we needed something to break the window. The garbage deposit is blocked as well on that stairwell. It doesn't even show anything down at the other room. Uh, if we could get through the thing B to our right, we'd be able to get into the archive, which leads us into that one through four room, but I don't know the point of that. Still no sign of day 45. Still no sign of fire extinguishers. Aha! There are UA fire extinguisher checklist. Survive the ARC project. Stop people from killing themselves. S survive the ARC project. Interesting way to phrase that. Send off C and the team. Keep people safe. Enjoy the rest of Armageddon. <laughs> Very interesting checklist. They're an interesting way of being written to. Quite like it actually. Uh no, nothing else there. Yeah, that was a bit louder than expected. Okay, Atkins is not alone, or at least proxy creatures. Uh check the seal doors, move downstairs, shuttle the Omicron. Dio. Isn't this the biggest base too? If they evacuate this place to Omicron, they might be canned in there. Um so this is who's dead, eh? And their position. Langsky is unknown. Jesus Christ. So many names. I to keep tra oh to keep track of them all, I would have really had to have written them all down. Notice this, eh? It's like a thing to connect to. Oh, override door lock. Oh, I can get in there now. What? Soon bell function locks limited active. Remaining resources zero. So Oh dude. Yeah. It's almost like I could trick one of those creatures into being in the room. You can also see here the areas that are locked off now more clearly. And you can see we're definitely not going to really get anywhere else. We could also do that. <gasps> I can make all the noise in the world. You can't touch me. Come and get me. Come and get me. You can't do shit. Can't do shit. Come on. Come on, you big beanbag. I'm safe. I got four windows here of safe aquatic glass. You can't touch me in here. And one hell of a locked door. <laughs> yeah, if I could only tri if only this was a multiplayer game, you could have one person in here. Oh, you bitch. Oh, you double bitch. Triple. Quadruple. In here, locking doors and one person elsewhere. Oh, that's interesting. That one's grayed out. I've been in there, though, haven't I? Yeah, I guess so. Um, we've already been in there. We don't need that room anymore for sure. Uh, these ones I don't actually know about. No, I've locked myself in. I can never get out again. Uh... Okay, cool. We should lock that one, honestly. 
Mm -hmm. Zach has like the dead person in there, right? Had, like the two dead people, like the one there and the one there. Then again, if all else, and this had a dead person in there as well. So it would just lock the doors with dead people in them. I was going to say then again, I might need to run out of here and hide in there, but we're just going to have to hide in corners in there. So yeah, there we go. Now we're all good. Even though I did unlock that door after I made all that noise. Let's, um, honestly, because we're going to stay in here just one more minute longer. Let's just lock this door. Um, yeah, is there something else I want to check? Is it under here? No. It's not. Okay. Fine. Good thing somebody didn't die in here with the door locked. That would have been terrible. Hey, you're locked in here forever. <laughs> or, uh, I guess, whenever I needed to come in here. I have no such luck. Oh, yeah, that was what I was going to do. Fine, whatever. Stromer, you there? I hear you, Brandon. What do you got? Akers and his critters are ferocious. They pick up on every move. There's no way past them. Then we'll fight them. We got to get to the shuttle. And end up like Shank and Adams? No way. Listen, I'll create a distraction and pull them to me. Get the gang to the shuttle station. Wait, Brandon, what are you doing? Don't worry, Alice. I'll loop back as soon as you guys are safe. Just load up the shuttle and be ready to go. Are you sure about this? I don't plan to die today, sir. See you at the shuttle. And he died. And now we get to go see his body. There's a vent right there. Hey, uh, Captain Spooky Pants. So that vent really just goes through one wall right into the other. I wonder if there's like a way to seal the vent. Alright, yes, you stupid idiot sage. You locked all the doors in the whole bloody world. So now if you find yourself in the need of running into a room real quick, all the doors are locked. Fantastic. Well, not necessarily locked, but closed. Ah, the roll stops. Nice and shabby. Don't be over here now, you son of a bitch. Keep walking, keep on walking, keep on Christopher walking, Christopher walking. Okay, cool. Oh, okay. Well, it's like, it's like supposed to be transmissions from a moon simulation or something. See, people would have been alright on the moon. Oh, dude, it's the guy we tortured. Fantastic. Or, I say tortured, tricked. It's more like it. Yeah, Brandon Wan. Awesome. Cool dude. I, I, there's no security number. Totally had my hands in the wrong place on the keyboard. Meant to move to my right a little bit and not turn on my flashlight. Let's see what your brain memories have to say. It looks like a suicide to me. I'd say it most definitely was. You have a nice yellow bracelet. Pink bracelet. Wait, so was he the guy being all heroic? Oh, it's like, you have to pull it to get it out of his hand. I'm sorry about before, Brandon. I'm sorry we couldn't let you rest in peace. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> yeah, so much for my theory about this place being totally trashed and abandoned for hundreds and hundreds of years. Is this a live feed? Is this what implied that the moon people are still fine? It's reminding me of the World War Z movie. 
the way the creatures in that way they like <laughs> before they came at you. You're a little bitch, you're a little bitch, you're a little bitch with no dick. <laughs> I've completely forgotten where I was going. Why did I need that thing? Probably for security. Are these windows still secure? Yes, they are. And there is no window thing, so let's lock the door. Oh, okay, let's lock this door too, just in case he comes back alive. Whew. Uh, system malfunction, lock them, it's active, remaining resources, something, something. Awesome, yeah, sure, whatever. Oh. 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 Get more games need like a safe room like this. So, connection chip detected. This is probably the chip I also needed for the elevator. Hey, sup, buddy? Sup? 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 Yo! You got a tiny dick! You got a tiny dick. Yeah, you got a tiny dick. Yeah, it had a bit of harness. It had a bit of bad harness. Ooh, you don't got nothing. You got nothing, Mrs. Fuzzy Fans. You got nothing. Look at you. You got your slimy legs and your tendril things moving. In. Moving in there. Yeah, you ain't got shit. Yeah, you fuck up. Man, he's got no eyes. I wonder if this is Atkins. Oh my god, it's like a vagina face thing. Yeah, I wonder if that used to be Atkins. Because it's got, like, more... A bit more human than otherwise. It's also odd that Atkins didn't make it back to base. Like, because he was taking the uh, Zeppelin. So at some point, I guess he must have just jumped off of it and started floating. That was awesome that we actually got to take a super close look at that. I'm glad they stopped doing what they did with Amnesia, which is, you know, make your whole screen go super blurry and you pass out and die for just looking at the thing. It was so damn annoying. Okay, security messages. Alert, dispatch, November 17th. Corrupted, corrupted. Yep, yep. And then, alert, machine hanger. Huge structure gel leak has caused the, wow, disease control over the, yep, done bat. Forced a quarantine to avoid further developments. Last thing we need is another talking machine. So apparently they were dealing with quite a few of them. These probably might have all been quarantines as well. Uh, key controls. <laughs> Error. Key expired. Please update. Okay, sure. Um, I guess if we had just put this in the elevator door and tried to get out of here, it probably would have been like, yeah, no, you're not going nowhere. Um, override door lock. Oh, this is still the same damn thing. We don't need this right now. Uh, key control. Update. Key chip. Watch it unlock all the doors. Cool. Connected. Awesome. Can chip updated, chip ready for use. It's odd that it needed to be updated at all. Uh, and then the door locks, we still got dead body, two dead bodies, dead body, all locked down. Um, of course that window could be broken. All we need to do is get out of here, make a beeline straight down the hallway and into here, or if need be, loop through there to avoid Captain Angry Pants. Yeah, or even through there. Pretty simple and straightforward now, really. Just gotta wait for him to leave. Wish I could do an alien isolation climb under the table. Why the heartbeat sound? Seriously, that's not cool. Oh shit. Did you hear that? <laughs> oh god. Come on, chair. Get over here. I, just in case you're making noise. I like the fact that these chairs are like too heavy to move otherwise, so you actually have to roll them. And they have some joints to them in the way they move. That's some really nice game design there. I like. Okay, well, that's all done. Shame I can't bring back online the lights here. 
so I can power off all sorts of stuff and just leave myself a path. Alrighty. Sounds like he's tomorrow right on me. I don't see him though. Is he at the door? I don't see him. Sounds like he's right around here. Sounds like he's right around here somewhere. For God's sakes, don't be outside the door. I'll just hide right here in case he is. Let's not move. Let's not move. Let's not look at him either since... Well, we can look at him. Well, he might know that we're somehow looking at him, honestly. Let's just... So, uh... Do you like pina coladas and, um... Getting caught in the rain? Because, uh... I, li I like pina coladas and, uh... Getting caught in the rain. You know, maybe we could hang out sometime. That was my chance to close the door. Of course, I guess I couldn't have locked. I couldn't have really locked the door with him, you know, in the room with the lock. Oh god! Come on! Go away! It's like every time I look at him, it also brings him back. It seems it's very annoying. See, I just looked at him there. Is he gonna turn around now? Yeah, he's walking away quicker now. There he's gone. Stand right there, huh? I'm gonna make a left. Bye! He's coming this way. Shit! Don't be right there, don't be right there, don't be right there. Good thing there's nothing on the floor in the dark here. King! <laughs> like that. Whatever that is. Of course, he's just gonna loop out right here. So I might have to go hide in one of these rooms. Or I could just go right over here. And hide right here like I was never here at all. I'm just a wall. Huh. Look at me. I'm part of the laboratory maintenance transportation saint. Street. Why are you freaking so much? He's gotta be like over there or something. I can't directly see him. Line of sight, son of a bitch. Asshole. These are some nice walls. I mean, the resolution could be higher, you know. You can tell it's just a 2D texture. The normal maps don't do squat when you're this close to them. But I mean, overall pretty nice. And they got the like, reflectivity bit. I guess it could just be part of the normal maps. I don't think this game is PBR done. If it was PBR done, uh, it'd probably be a bit shinier. And you can see here that's some, I almost want to call it laziness, but it's to be expected. A lot of, it's hard to make your uh, seams like that seem there, line up perfectly with all the walls. And also, as I said, with the resolution of the textures, it would be nicer if they're a little bit higher. That way that little, that black seam wouldn't, would actually be a little black seam instead of that, you know, pretty damn hefty black seam. Nice art style though, nonetheless. Don't care at this point. Bye. Yes. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa. It's just a window, right? It's actually glass there. Yeah, there is. Yeah, of course. Of course that happened. So I guess it didn't matter what floor I selected that was going to happen. Are we going to fall even farther now? Something will come through so you don't want to knock me out and wake me up elsewhere. Is that just going to be part of the game? Well, I guess I got lucky I didn't just fall through it, eh? Okay, 
Can I just climb back inside? It's not. Okay, fine. 